social scientists are scholars who study how and why social processes occur and how our society work. So this means answering questions like, um, why do people fight with each other? Um, how can we get poverty down? Um, how do people respond when migrants move into a community? Um, and importantly, I think as well that you know, we social scientists do not only want to understand the world, but also make it a little bit better. One way research questions stem from are, and that's I think the most common way, uh, is uh, from the, the social events that happen around us, that perplex or confuse us, and that require a greater understanding. The biggest advantage of participant observation and interviewing is to access to very fine-grained data that tells us um, the cultural meanings and the social patterns that shape a social context. What's the benefit of this? This gives us a better, more complex, more nuanced picture of society and how society works. So for me, one of the advantages, so this is not particularly academic related, but it's just a lot of fun. Um, so one of the great things is you have to carry a lot of different hats when you do field research. Like on the one hand, at times you're the diplomat and you have to interact with organizations like the World Bank or International Rescue Committee, talk with implementing partners. Um, the next moment you're the manager, where you've got 120 people running around in the field collecting data for you and you have to organize a USB that doesn't fit, uh, a new GPS systems have to be bought, these very kind of logistical nitty gritty things. Um, on the other hand as well, you're, you're also the nerdy academic where you get piles of data coming in and, and you have to process it and you have to see what the structure is in the data. Um, and at times you're Indiana Jones, you're running through the jungle and you're driving around on a motorbike, uh, keeping, uh, keeping abreast of what's going on. And that's, that's just a combination of those different things. That's a fantastic thing about field research. Just the fact of being located in Abu Dhabi in the region forces me to take a more regional perspective and to think about uh, these issues uh, the, the, between religion and politics and the role of Islamist actors in politics. Uh, think about these issues from a regional, from a broader perspective, not just in the context of Turkey, but in the context of the region, because the, they are so relevant and important um, actors in, the, in, in various countries around the region. So before coming here, I was in New York City for, for a good number of years and getting to Eastern Congo would, would mean traveling for about two days. Um, and now it's you leave at night and you, you arrive early in the morning. Um, so this is, a, this is a big change. So just practically, that's a, that's a wonderful thing given the, this location. The other one is NWA Abu Dhabi is a very kind of young entrepreneurial university and doing field work, that's a fantastic thing. So it means that if you've got a good idea, you want to meet with colleagues or you need some funds in order to do something, people over here very quickly say, great idea, go for it. Um, and it's one of the things that's fantastic when you're kind of a, a young researcher specifically doing field work. <laughs>